Well, here's one car we forgot about that hasn't been started since April. The El Taramino. And I think we've got a B problem too. So I've got a battery, a beer, and everything but B protection. But I'm prepared. More bees, please. Oh. Eh, a little bit growed in. Almost set. Let's do a pre bee inspection. Nothing under the hood. Big spider web. Uh oh. More fucking bees. I can hear that, can you? <laughs> Sounds like there's a whole nest of them in there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There's definitely a lot of those fuckers. Well, good thing it's a cool day and they're not too aggressive. Are you scared, Wolf? So, let's see if I got the right key. Whoa! Fucking things. Yep, now I just gotta put the battery in. Are you afraid of bees? Nah, they strung me so, so many times I just <laughs> rip them off and crush them real fast. Well, we'll have to think of a way to get rid of these bastards. Right? Well, battery's in. Now I get to fight my way through all them fucking burrs. Spider webs. You abused alcohol. Uh oh, don't tell anybody. <laughs> what, no bees in this door? Nope. Cool. Alrighty. Shut up, Wolf. Let's do this shit. Priming it a little. Come on. Oh, it sometimes starts up perfect. Why don't you hammer the pedal a bit for all the fetishists? <laughs> oh yeah, I gotta pump it, pump it. That didn't do fuck all either. Mission feels all stiff. Maybe it did do something. <laughs> Pop it some more! <laughs> Fucking burrs. It's doing something. Loop, 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 loop. Yes! running on six cylinders yet. Oh, here it comes. Sweet. Oh, oh, piece of shit. Okay, now go stand. Well, the reason I 
getting this beast running now is it was always draining the battery. If you left the battery hooked up, the alternator drained it, and it only charged a little tiny bit while you were driving it. So luckily for me, Cody Wright of Arizona sent me his alternator off his diesel Ford truck, which he's scrapping, and it looks like a rebuilt one. And it just so happens to be the right one for this car. It's a 3 liter. Hard to believe, eh? Well, I did have a bad alternator in my Ford truck, which is way over yonder, up till this spring, and I had to pay $100 to get it rebuilt. Now the whole truck's nothing wrong with it. So this last piece of shit's the only one that I'm going to have to fix. Every other car, in the now, car on the farm now I think has a good alternator. Now I just got to switch pulleys. Exact match. set out with the old and with the new Cody now we got to test your alternator and see if it's working all righty Now we've got to deal with that serious B problem, so we've got a new solution. And it ain't a flamethrower, and that's not propane. That's recycled Freon from those mountains of air conditioners. Let's give them the big freeze. <laughs> yeah. Now there's some behind that mirror. I don't know how we're going to get those. Oh, look at all of them. But we should deal with those no problem. Hey, right. in here. Is it recording? Yep. In here is Freon. If I turn it upside down, liquid Freon will come out. Oh dear. And that will freeze them. <laughs> so, this is real heavy. Oh. You ready? Here we go. Oh, that looks cold. Let's see if he warms up and comes back to life. <laughs> I'm David Blaine. I'm resurrecting a dead fly or a bee. Oh, its ass is starting to wiggle. You see that? Oh, boy. The breath of life. <laughs> it's coming. Let's put him there. Shall we do I'm some shock? I'm going to revive my co-stars for scene two. We're going to do some shock and awe? <laughs> Maybe. I completely fucked up that scene where you were showing it. Look at that frozen nest. Holy crap. You see the coldness just falling out of there. Oh, they moved to the outside. There's another frozen one. Oh, let's do the shock and awe. Oh. How does that shock you? <laughs> Poor thing. I don't know, I think that did a little damage. He's still a bit alive. He's looking at me. Peekaboo. That's very effective. There's another three degree B. He's a little bit more alive. Half froze. Yeah, they're all froze. They think it's winter. I can see snow. Anybody want a bee burger? No mushrooms? I mean, uh, no tomatoes? <laughs> Ooh. It's got a little kick left in them. <laughs> 
I think we're ready to go for a drive now. We got a bee free zone. <laughs>